What's up guys, I'm Phoenix Master 1 and welcome to this week's Resonant Battles free to play guide. So last week we got promoted to Interval 20 and uh, my eyes are not deceiving because this week it seems like we might be able to go up to Interval 21 even without any harmonic unit. And at worst we might be able to stay in Interval 20 which is really great. So this week we have got Echoes and Togemurat Session as the bonus title. And we only have one harmonic unit that you could use and that is Bright Catria. And that banner isn't really all that popular, not many people pulled on that banner, so it might be possible to go up to interval 21. But in any case, if you guys do enjoy these consistent Resonant Battles guides, then make sure to leave a like and subscribe as I do upload a lot of free to play guides for many of the game modes. So that said, let us begin. So this week is pretty annoying because we don't have too many free to play units from Echoes and we only have one from Tokyo Mirat Session. We don't even have any kind of like really good fast unit. So if you have Brave Salika in place of Itsuki, it's gonna be really easy for you. But for the rest of us who cannot really use her, then uh, yeah, this is pretty much what you have to do with him. You gotta give him lunch, that is gonna be extremely helpful. And you can run Triangle Adept on his slot A. And you only need Triangle Adept 2, you don't really need version 3 here. And you can even run like Death Blow if you want to, and run a special here. Because Soul is not helping in Resonant Battles whatsoever. And Blade Session pairs up really well with this weapon in general. So try to have that for the max amount of attack that we will definitely, definitely need. And then you want to have Renea as your dancer. She's a free to play dancer, so that helps. And you want to have Escape Route 1 on her slot B. You do not need version 2 or version 3 here, and this will suffice. You need to have Drive Attack Sacred Seal on her so that uh, Itsuki can finish off Hellbendy. And then you want to have any kind of Cavalier. We have got Conrad. In a few days, we're getting Fernand. We also have Clive, Matilda. So you can have any Cavalier, really, with Smite and Wings of Mercy 1. And that should be helping. I'm pretty much trying to teleport with uh, Renea's Escape Route 1 and using Wings of Mercy on that. So you want to have Smite on this unit. Make sure to have that. And the final unit is the placeholder where you could use your harmonic unit, Bright Catria in this case. So I'm using Tatiana, extremely recent unit, she actually just came out uh, today. So I'm running attack, opening, her default skill as well as drawback. So you will need drawback on this kind of unit or reposition. Any skill really that can pull back the Cavalier from the threat range. So this works out and you can run Bright Catria pretty easily in this position. And uh, if you're not running Tatiana for her attack opening, then you can also run um, attack tactic here on Renea. If you're running someone who's not, uh, you know, an infantry unit like Bright Catria, who's a flying unit, so tactic skill is gonna be uh, useful there. So that is gonna be my team. Uh, definitely was a bit annoying this week, but still, yep, Krom taught him how to do resonant battles, so let's go over here and uh, dance up Itsuki and uh, also smite Renea. And now Blade Session is in full force, so that is good. And we just take out this Hellbendy. We don't even have any unit who can like outspeed these very fast thieves, which is definitely pretty annoying. Itsuki is our best bet here. We haven't really got too many Shadows of Valentia units and... So now you want to smite your Itsuki. And then you want to draw back your Cavalier or reposition them. Doesn't exactly matter what you do uh, here, honestly. Any of those two skills can work. And now you want to go ahead and take out the Screen Thief. And as you can see, we get an exact lethal. On Interval 21, you will definitely need some juice on him. You can definitely go for Triangle Adept 3. But for Interval 20, Triangle Adept 2 just suffices uh, for this. And then you want to teleport with Renea with her escape route. Because she took damage from Lagarn. And that's why I smited her in the range of uh, Lagarn. In Interval 21, you could probably give her HP plus 3 or something like that. To make sure that she can survive. So you want to break that wall with Itsuki. And just take out uh, that Hellbendy. And now you want to go ahead and attack this Blue Thief. Use Dance's Veil, which we just got. And then you want to have your Barkut over here. And... I mean, Tatiana can be anywhere. Her job is done. And now we have got enough juice to take out that Green Thief, which is really great. And we can teleport with Renea's escape route and just swap places. So we can pretty much have a choke point here um, to stop these units. So we'll just attack this Red Thief. And we can just have Renea and Itsuki block the path. 
Leave it to me. And we can go like this. this go. And block the path of this blue thief. There's only a uh, few thieves left. These two are on low HP, so that is good. So now you want to go ahead and finish off this red thief with Burkut, get that infantry boots. And you want to go over here with Itsuki and then teleport with Renea. And you don't want to attack because you will lunge this red thief and you will die. So that's why you should not be lunging and attacking that red thief. Just try to T-pose him for as long as you can and that should help. And now you want to use Renea to support Burkut and just dance him up. Just like that cutscene and... Uh, attack this blue thief and keep attacking him do it. and now he can trigger his aoe special so that is going to be finishing the job here to get a lightning charm which we are definitely going to be using Leave it to me. and again just uh, body block this red thief and now let's right. move our units Ready. to get the blade session effect so we can do that and then dance up itsuki and just take out this red thief so that is it for this week, uh, had to use a bit of skill inheritance because our options are quite limited for these games. So hopefully this can help you and uh, make sure to share this video with your friends because it's not often that we can stay in interval 20 or even go up to interval 21 without any kind of harmonic unit. So this might be a pretty unique week after many 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 months. So make sure to make full use of this and I want to thank all of my YouTube members for the constant support. If you enjoyed then please be sure to leave a like and a comment, helps you tremendously and be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell because expecting YouTube sub boxes to work is like expecting Itsuki to double any of these insanely fast ninjas. So that's it, I'll see you guys next time, thank you so much for watching and have a great day.